Rainbow Robot Blur. I haven't found a Holstein cow yet, but I have spent an awful lot of time collecting new animals. Okay. Does the manual say, like, if they're found in a particular biome or something? I'm sorry, what? What was that? Does the uh, Animania manual say if uh, particular um, breeds are found in particular biomes or anything? Yes, apparently Holstein cows are found in forests. Okay. I have just uh, put a marker about 500 ticks away from uh, your nuclear reactor because okay. that village is in um, territory that produces Animania animals. Okay. And... Uh, I see other biomes nearby. Okay. But I've filled up all of my uh, safari nets, so I came back to <laughs> um, empty them. Yeah, I suppose. I would like to have a book that goes straight to that village, but I have completely forgotten how to make Animania books work. Miscraft books, you mean? Animania Miscraft books work, yeah. Yeah. Do you want me to explain it, or...? Uh... Sure, why don't you? Okay, so, um, first you have to make a unlinked linking book. There it is. Uh, oh, and it doesn't tell you the recipe for those. Um, but I believe, uh, you need, um, what are they called? Cover page? No. A link panel page. Uh, which you make... It doesn't tell you how to do that either. Which you make in an ink mixer. Uh, with ink and some blank paper. And then you put that link panel page with a piece of leather in a crafting grid, and that makes you an unlinked link book. Okay. And then you stand where you want it to link to, and right-click with it, and it will link to there. And you place it on a bookstand somewhere else. It has to be in a different dimension, though. And then that'll take you there. Mm. Make sense? Yes. So, you need a pot of ink, though, right? You can't just use an ink sack? Um, I mean, you make it with ink sacks or black dye. But you need uh, a bottle of water and two black dye to make one ink vial. And then you need an ink mixer, which I've got one at the at the Mistcraft hub there, to actually make the link panel page. Is it possible to put a flower in a flower pot, like yes. for a display? How do you do that? Do you know? I think you right click on the flower pot with the flower, or maybe shift right click. Maybe you do it in a crafting grid. I don't. I don't really remember. I just tried it in a crafting grid. Is it a vanilla flower? It's not a vanilla flower. Yeah, I think it probably only works with vanilla flowers. But the bluebells are so pretty. Huh. <laughs> I have a Plymouth Rock hen and a and a white pea hen nesting in the same nest. <laughs> That's funny. So I'm pretty sure that what we have coming up there is the Elysian Fields, I think. That might be Underground Jungle, though. Hmm. Okay, so here I am in the Elysian Fields. I'm going to go exploring and see what I can find. Just over here, there's more petrified forest. And there's a tree here I haven't seen before. Oh, yes, I have scorched wood. I found some of that 
first time I went to the Petrified Forest, I think. The way the calves grow is pretty interesting, because it's... Like, now that I've put, put he or she next to the, uh, the Tree of Time... Uh-huh. I can see periodically the, like, slight swelling of the body. Hmm. Like, it just gets ever so slightly bigger. So I have come across something called a Tall Bloom, which I can harvest with shears. But it kind of looks like it might be... I don't know, Venus flytrappy in some way. But hmm. I've got it, so I guess we're good. I've got mahogany tree, but I think I already brought some mahogany back, right? Yes. Okay. More mahogany. Amaranth, which you already have. Yep. There are giant mushrooms here. I'm back in the underground jungle. Ha, <laughs> no wonder. These in fields are not very big. So they go back this way, into the hill. How would I find that out? Following the right along here? Just test me back to the underground jungle. There's not a whole lot of Elysian fields here. <laughs> hmm. I managed to grow a mahogany tree. Cool. It grows with uh, thorns on it. Oh, okay. So they... Oh, you mean instead of vines? Yeah, I mean, it, uh, the readout says that it's thorns. Oh, okay. Huh. So the reason fields continue in this direction, huh? Oh. Oh. I think it finally grew up. And okay. it's another bull. Darn it! Uh, that's frustrating. Yeah. Aha! Oh, there we go. Starting to see some giant flowers in the Elysian Fields. Looks like there's a better way through into this area as well. I think I need to build a barn. <laughs> what's, what's the saying? You closing the barn door after the cows have left? Building a barn? It's, a it's after you have too many cows already? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, we're finally in proper Elysian fields. They're somewhat big. There's moss on the ceiling. There's giant flowers in the distance. There's also some swamp plants here because I think we're on the very edge of the swamp as well. Oh, those are some new trees. And the giant flowers. Would you like to uh, come look at the Elysian fields? And then um, we'll call it good for tonight? Sure. Okay, sure. Okay. Cool. I will come back and give you directions. Let me just uh just It'll get It'll take a few me a while to get in. back, so. Okay. You will need a minecart, among other things. Well, mainly a minecart. So you might want to make yourself a minecart.
Okay, I'm back in the overworld. Where are you? Okay, um, I'm uh, just about ready to come back to Twilight Forest. Okay. Um, but I'm currently on Rustic Kill in my in my spot. Yeah, I'm heading for the Twilight Forest too. Then I'll meet you there. Okay. Hello. Hello. Okay, so to get to Elysian Fields, we go back to the overworld. Okay. Don't forget to close the door behind you. Here's the Orbis portal. And we go through. Alright. Okay. So then if we go up these stairs over here. If you look through this okay. door, you can see the underground jungle. The underground jungle? Yep. Oh, cool. That's where Should I got I the, uh, okay. um, uh, the mahogany trees. Ah. What the heck happened to the minecart? <laughs> I left a minecart oh. here. Now wait till I've gone a little ways before you go. Okay. I'm behind you. Yep. Hopefully you're not catching up. <laughs> I appear to be staying the same distance behind you. Cool. So this is what it looks like on top of the Erebus. It's nice and flat. Okay. Yeah. I should maybe ride my horse around up here sometime. Incredibly green. Well, that's just the underground jungle. Hmm. See, there's another biome over there to our left. Not sure what it is. I should check that out at some point. That might be one I haven't made a staircase to yet. Maybe the map will tell me. Oh, that's Elysian Fields. Haha, <laughs> that's the one we're going to visit. Oh no! My, my minecart's going back towards you. Now you've got the minecarts. So mm -hmm. you'll see here we have a sign. It's a petrified forest that way, ulterior out back that way. Um, I haven't put a sign up for the Elysian Fields, but they're this way. Okay. You did go down, right? Yes. And west. And through this door? Uh... Are you sure you're going west? Oh, I'm going east. Hello. Hi. It looks like you're high kicking your way down the stairs. Uh, so then we go to the right here. Okay. And turn left. You go down some more stairs. Around the stairs, there's a door, but we don't go through this door. Because it leads to the tiny Elysian Fields. We go through the... Oh no, we do go through this door. We go through the upper door. I need to put some signs up. <laughs> okay, and there's one more tunnel here. And one more set of stairs. These don't have stair stairs on them yet. Here we are. In the Elysian Fields. Kind of wow. over this way. There's a swamp to the right-ish. But over here, we're in the Elysian Fields. Huh. And there are these trees that I've never seen before. And these giant flowers as well. And dragonflies, it looks like. I don't know whether the dragonflies attack you, so be wary of them. These are cypress trees. Hmm. Do you have cypress trees yet? I do not. 
You can go check out the giant flowers. You can cut down a cypress tree if you want. Now these bushes here, what are they called? Ferns. Erebus ferns. Stem. Currently harvestable. Magenta petal block. I honestly don't know what any of this does. For all I know, we, we try to cut them down and bees come after us. That would not be unlike the Erebus. I don't know, should I try? And cut uh, down a flower and see what happens? If you wish to, but you might want to wait. There's a there's a crab guy behind you. Crab guy? Oh, hi. Mm. No, that's not uh, a crab, crab guy. guy. Yeah. That's an abyssal zombie. He came from the swamp over there. All the way over here to the Elysian Fields to get me. And a magenta petal block. Mm -hmm. So if we break a magenta petal block, do we get anything? No. Unless you got something, did you get anything? Oh, I did. I got a magenta petal block. Okay, cool. Oh, there was something lighting yeah, up in the middle of the flower. What did you Rainbow get? Rainbow flower seeds is what I have now. Oh, fun. Well, I guess you'll have to try yeah. and plant those and see what you get. Yeah. And then, this, oh, looks like you can get the stem blocks too. Do you want other colors of giant flower petal blocks? Looks like there's red and white around here. And, and blue. blue over there. Do you have enough room in your inventory for all this? Yeah. Okay, cool. Just don't pick this thing up by accident. What is it? Uh, I think it's some kind of diseased flesh from that zombie. Oh. Oh, there are more zombies yes. over there. I'll take care yeah. of them while you cut down this, uh, this flower. I'm taking off my magnet ring just in case. Yeah. Oh, there's a there's a mosquito looking thing here. It is a mosquito. I killed the mosquito. I got whatever this is. Life blood, which heals you. Interesting. Now this is another tree I haven't seen before. What is this? Marshwood. A marshwood tree with marshwood wood. This is probably on the edge of the uh, of the swamp. That's why it's oh, wow. much wood. It's massive. Yeah. I don't think I want to cut it down because I don't want to crash the server. <laughs> I'll see if I can get some saplings from the uh, from the leaves. Okay. Hi. There's a moth here. Do you have any safari nets? I do. You try and capture a dragonfly. Or a moth. Okay, marshwood leaves. Any marshwood saplings, eh? Huh? Ah, I think I got one. That was not There's it, though. There's a giant... Where did it drop? I saw it fall. I didn't pick it up, though. Giant what? There's a great big bee-looking thing that came out of it. Out of the flower? Okay. Out of the flower that I broke, yeah. Uh, hopefully it won't attack you. It did not attack me. Moth seems relatively content to just fly around. Oh, that was... Not a good noise. I think it's prob- oh, hi. There's a zombie in the tree with me. We 
person he seems to be in a part of the tree where he can't quite get at me. I'm having trouble throwing shurikens at him now because there's a vine in the way. Okay. Do have space in my inventory. Okay, did I get something? Yes, a marshwood sapling. Where are you? I see you. Oh, there's a... There's a grasshopper over here. Hmm. Hi, grasshopper. Dangerous? Are you... Aggro? I don't think so. Probably capture this grasshopper if you want. I think it's I don't really like the Erebus creatures very much. Mm hmm Oh my goodness, that's a lot of zombies over there. Maybe we should go. Yeah. Yeah, let's get out of here. Okay. 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 Can you say goodbye? Yep. Bye for now. Yep. Bye for now. Warning, warning, this video is almost over. Warning, warning, it's time to choose another one. This has gone on far too long, time to wake up and sing along. Warning, warning, this video is over now.